Hello and welcome to our second half of the Tour Down Under with our Black Folk Pro Cycling Academy career playthrough. Let's, before we start, let's just go through the results of last stage. Stage 3, we got away a little bit, of course a small bit of a gap, and Matteo Trenton took his second stage win with Bagheel, Bevan, and Martinez head of the sprinting bunch, however, PCM did not count the gap. Stage 2, Trenton pipped Ewan at the post, and Stage 1, Trenton came in 6th. So overall, we are leading by 5 seconds with Matteo Trentin, winning the points classification, 2nd on youth, and 8th on team. Today's stage is relatively flat, with that small little hill at the end which we will try to make a move on. Otherwise, let's get the stage underway. The favourites before the stage, <coughs> according to PCM, <coughs> were Valverde, Trentin, and Bevan. So we will, what we'll do is we'll use Rumak to protect Trentin, and I'll support to protect Bevan. Is again pretty alright. Same with Trentin, and the breakaway has already gone away. Now, you will note with Matteo Trentin's jersey, it's got the cyanide error because there are no, uh, what do they call the back and front panels for Black Spoke Pro Cycling Academy yet. So, that's probably the next thing I end up doing before I end up doing those national champ shirts, which I'm probably going to keep putting off for a while. Yeah, the breakaway is quite big. Are they actually getting away? Kind of just. Well, Saffron still a lot of people are dead in the bunch. Ewan. A lot of dead riders. Rumak. Oh, Saffron. A lot of people are on the back already. Scully is dying. Crest over the climb. The breakaway now got a decent lead. Bolvin. Schultz, Brunel, Power, the Rusche, Haas, Legnos, Squeegens, and Power. It's a pretty strong breakaway. Let's send Scully back to get some water now. There's more than three people in the front bunch. So we won't sprint there. Same there either. We'll just wait for this finish line. For the hilly sprints. Meanwhile, off camera, I have been putting some more effort in to get the, the planner sorted. So I've done up to the Tour de France now with the races. I'm just putting in the ones around the Tour de France uh, afterwards and the ones before the Vuelta as well. I made a bit of a change to our Vuelta squad, but we will see. So our sponsor wants us to win the Giro. Oh, so top three in the Giro. Points in the Vuelta and top three in the Tour. So I think we're sending Buggy to the Tour, as he's the French champion now. Uh, we're sending Poggy to the Giro and the Vuelta. We're also sending Ev, Nepal and Bivin to the Vuelta. And Bennett as a sprinter. Um, I'm not quite sure yet. I can't quite remember what the, who the other major domestics are. Uh, Tim Wellens punctured, but he's back in the bunch now. Scully. Sending back to some more water. Doing quite well on time with only Scully and our Cyprot losing time. Scully is a faithful domestic in real life for EF Education First. Come on. About 10 k's till the climb, 20 k's to go. Let's just get a train read now. Scully, you, Rumak, Martinez, Trentin, well, sorry, Bug, Heel, Trentin, 
even on the end, why not? Just go where you make a pace, start pacing now. So you want to be on the front for this downhill because it's usually very tricky otherwise. Yeah, it's tricky, okay. Energy gel, because you will not be making it up this hill. Come on, Skelly, get up there, get up there, go, 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 go. Oh, come on, no, don't get locked through here, don't get locked through here. Let's go, go, go. Okay, so we're gonna have, what's our strategy? Maybe a tank with Martinez or Bagheel. So we're on the climb now, our steep's the climb, it's reasonably steep. Okay, energy gel on our side throat. Who's attacking? Who's this? Little bear, a shazy. Scully, bye bye. Don't block me! Don't block me! Mouse up there, Cochlear, Port Nielsen. Go down, bye bye to you. Off to the side, please. You don't block them. Go on, attack. 40 meters. To the top. Don't. How are you blocking him? Let's go, Martinez. Launch your attack. You get on the back of the bunch. Where's. Trink? Oh, they're caught behind. Uh, the slight gap. Little Mark is chasing, so we'll just sit him up. For now. Well, Trimton's now chasing. Set so him up. On the back of Lutschenko. On the back of Lutsch. Damn it. Oh, well, this is confusing. Why is my camera angle retarded? There it is there. Sprint for the buggy. Oh, go, 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 go. Any, any kind of. And uh, Walshford with Trenton and Bivin. And Warren Bagheel takes the stage ahead of Martinez. <laughs> Trenton and Bivin. Okay. So that's another kind of. Um, say too easy of a stage. The riders are too good. Skelly's going to come in last for our squad. Uh, we tried to sprint with him, didn't really work. I did check the duck hoodie, and it is on extreme. So I don't quite know what is happening. Is there a time gap here? No, there's not, once again. Is it the same four as last time? Yes, it is. The same four, but a different order. With this time gap. Yep, so a lot of riders lost time. Maybe the sprinters keep it up here. So it makes Trenton first, Bagheel second, and Ewan third, and we take fourth, fifth, and sixth. And points are sketched for Trenton. Blue Mark takes the mountain with Martinez behind. Martinez in the youth with Galdu behind. And Eve Education and Altima's third on the points. Okay, so that, that was unexpected. I've well, I've done that before a few times actually. Usually, Ella Philippe's here. Ella Philippe is not fun to verse in this game. He is too overpowered, in my opinion. Oh, Power Summon Palms North is at the New Zealand Cycle Classic. Power Summon North is actually a town which is just south of where I live. Well, south of where I live. So, the sprint stage today with Kroonewagen being the favourite. Ewan, Ackerman, Jakobsen, Trentin. Hmm. That's a bit. Oh, I hope Trentin wins. I hope, wow. That climbing stage is going to be the difference. Stage 5. Oh, I forgot to do who they actually won. So, stage 4 was won by. Caleb Ewan, Glover Sam Bennett, Jesper Philipson, Glyphal, Dynasty. <coughs> so it's actually pretty reasonable that the sprinters won that. 
stage four. Okay. Stage five, today's stage was won by Nazolo. Then Konswani, Bennett, Morkov, Philipson, Greipel, Halverson, Ewan, Flyne, and Impey. Hmm. Okay, so. No, that's pretty stage. And we're in lots of jerseys and we need to fix that, that issue there. 85 on the Emperor 1. Sit up the front. Don't sit in the gutter. Uh, Milton Else, you can protect Bivin with Rumak protecting Trentine. Let's have a look at this mountain classification. He is 4 points behind. We, you get 10 points for winning. As long as he's another breakaway, which we should be fine. <laughs> Moscow, let's fast forward. Another sprint stage, so we may as well just not really do much until we get to the end. I might have taken too good of a team to this race. That could be the problem. I, have, I mean, I have got Bug Gear, which is kind of not usually who comes to this race. Though you're just in the best team, unless you're an Australian leader. Hmm. Yeah, because Richie Port wins overall, he's an Australian. Otherwise, Van Bala. Well, Simon Yates was here, actually, with Durham B. George Bennett. Per Steiner of Bora. Let's get some bottles with Scully. Wait, why isn't uh, whatever? Scully's got flat. Bed climbers stall Rumak. Seventeen still leads the points. Very odd. What I might do is after this episode, I might go in with the Pro Cycling Manager Career Explorer. I might actually up the difficulty that way. There's a crash. And a Kausler and Sabatini. No one is coming back for them. They're not anywhere in GC. 102nd, 103rd GC, respectively. So, no one's going to do any mules. By the time of recording this, the date today is the 6th of April. And today, Sam Buley and George Bennett actually just released the first episode of their cycling podcast where they interview Shane Archbold. Now that is a laugh. They have a lot of technical problems, but it's really funny, and it's really cool to see the cyclists interacting with each other the way they are, the Kiwi cyclists. I would recommend checking that out if you haven't already. Um, I suppose I put the link in the description. Bit of right note. But, yeah. That was a really good... I had to slow it down so I don't miss the point. Yep. Who's at the back still? Oh, Rossetto. I actually played a Cofidis career with the 2019 Cofidis, and we made it up to the World Tour. Um, I think we had Vivi, not Viviani, Viviani joins the team. I think we took Bennett, no, we didn't take Bennett, um, we got rid of Buhani, picked up, La, uh, made Laporte the main sprinter, took a Demar, uh, Quintana, few other big names. Send Scully back to get some water now. Before we line up, start the sprint. Line up times two as we get closer. Hmm. So who are we going to sprint for today? Trenton 78 77. Bivin is 77 77. Okay. We are sprinting for a Mateo Trentin. Come on, Scully, get past the bottles. I know there's only 20k's to go, but still need to drink the Vosa. Okay, 20k's to go times one. Let's go. Tildars, 
Put Scully in the middle there. Martinez is 71. Put you there. Bivin. Put Bug. Bug you. Here. Trentin here. Cool. Who is Mosh Moschetti? He's fourth on points. So attack for Hollenstein and Asgran. Asgreen. From the front bunch. And they're setting up again. Okay. I do like these National Champs jerseys. Oh, come on, don't get blocked. Oh, come on, guys. On the other side of the road to the Sudel train, who are leading out Ewan with Dagen Kolb. Can we take a third stage win with Matteo Trentin? Fourth stage win for the team. And stage five. It sounds a bit excessive. Put energy gel on, and what we're going to do is we're actually just going to up it to 93. I'll put you on now. Bye. Now we're gonna get away. Be on the back. I suppose 99. They just blitz through the energy, but that's what I'm used to. To be don't get blocked. Come around, come around, come around, come around, come around. Pull the train over. Let's go. There we go. And launch for Scully. Buggy, you can hop on the back. Energy on Martinez. 99 it. Speed it up, let's go. 46 k an hour, increasing speed slowly. 47, 48, 49, 50. Yes, boys. And Martinez can go now. Scully, off you go. Bye bye to the back. Energy gel on all three of these now. Rumaki can start sprinting. Really a bit late. There goes Tunison and Grunova again. Bevan can launch. Through the middle, 1k to go, Trentin, come on, come on, come on, come on. Trentin and you win, Trentin and you win, Trentin, you win, Trentin kind of gets blocked, looks like Jakobsen maybe. Caleb Ewan beats Jakobsen, then Trentin, then Bevan. With Hrunewegen coming in near the back after that early lead out by his teammate. Okay, so we cannot win a pure sprint, it seems, but we can win technical sprints. Let's fast forward this and let's get stage 6 over and done with. Then we'll do the next episode where I'll probably recap all the one day races we just had. Maybe recapping how the new uh, difficulty is. Seeing if it's good, whether it's bad. There we go, third and fourth. Ewan takes his second stage win. Ewan, decent lose time. Schwarzman, Tullhook, Harper. Last I said, oh, no, still last leading. Now you end up to second. Still holding the top six places. This hill should, should uh, what do you say, separate the favourites, but co most common in this game is no, it does not. And what instead happens is that the sprinters can keep up and the sprinters end up winning overall. Okay, um, I'll be the Gravel and Tar, not the Zealand Solid Classic. That makes more sense. Stage 6 in real life was run by Ma won by Matthew Holmes of Lotto Sudel. The Richie Port, his favourites today are Valverde, Formolo, Wellens, Woods, Scaldu, Conrad, Bakhiu, Martinez. So it went Holmes, Port, Barrel, Armiral, Stora, Ulysses, Geshka, Dennis. Van Bala and then Yates. With overall going to Richie Port, you'll, then you'll see Geshka, Dennis, Van Bala, MP, Yates, George Bennett, Hamilton, and Hearn Steiner. Mountain classification was Joey Roskoff, Sprints to Philipson, Young Rider to Sibakov, and Team Classification to Team Ineos. Hmm. Very interesting race here. Very interesting indeed.
Okay. Oh, still giving up the transfer arc, I remember that. Everyone's on a happy day today with Mugil and Bivin looking good. Okay, let's move everyone up to the front. Let's look at points. Oh, I can't be bothered to have the mountain points. Well, actually, we should be caught back up again by the time we get there, so there's nothing happening in the break. Mark, that is, who's second, Martinez, uh, may as well use Tildas as Bakil. And so that's 72. And we use Scully on Bivin just to protect him. Otherwise, everyone else. Fast forward. Who's in the breakaway? Musero, I've got him in my beer manager team. Brunel, Postoboka, Haga, and Kuzin. Being paced back down by Edmondson, Mitchell, and Scott. Sabatini of Kofidis, and is that Israel? Yes, it is. Oh, there's another big attack. A lot of riders going forward now. Oh, Christian Arking, Seaberg, Vakon, Vermont, Schultz, and Bolben. Let's keep that speed going on the video. Sprint, not us. People at the back, it looks like. Ooh, Buhani. Did he fall back? No. Yes, Buhani. Got dropped a bit. Where has Buhani been in these race in these stages? Stage one of the sprint stage. Where's Nessa Buhani? There he is, fifth. Okay. Stage two. Uh, Buhani. Twenty first. Stage three. Filters. What team's he in? Kofidis. No, Honey's not with Kofidis. Akia. Oh, Honey, four minutes down. Stage four, no. Stage five, you're at twelfth. Okay. You need to get some bottles. We'll send the Rumak back. He's our domestic. Or today, go like that because the plus button was not working. Still at 102 12 Ks to go. Keeping the pace up. Remark going hard. Coffers is chasing them, chasing this down. Who's Coffers right now? Coffers has got Viviani, haven't they? No. So totally a Viviani. Oh, uh, lol. I probably mentioned that in another video being uh, Ilya Viviani, and I, great. Yeah, right after the Coppers career, and uh, Akia Samson career, actually. Because the Tolio is, counts pretty good. Uh, let's grab some more water with Remark Y on the keyboard. Once we get to the second sprint, we'll have a look. Now, for the first time around the hill, we won't make a train. We will. Uh, what do we do? We'll move Scully onto the front, doing some work. And we'll change the domestics. We'll put the Rubak onto Bivin. Let's do that now. So, Rubak onto Bivin. It's kind of odd we're not protecting the team, but okay. Scully, move you up to the front of this, but let's show our face in the front of the peloton, boys. Fun fact, I was actually originally going to do a pro cyclist uh, video series. I had it all set up, I had chosen my, I chose an actual pro rider, I had got it all, got it all set up, uh, done a trial run, then I leveled up, and the attributes did not increase. So I will have a look into that a bit later on. So 17 go place the top. Scully's doing some work on the front for us. Well, near the front. He's not on the front yet. Map. Map. Do 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 do. I'm just doing a little lap of this. 
all along the hill. Not on the hill yet, so we can keep going. It's currently on the front now, working. Good boy. Probably should have grabbed water a bit earlier. Okay, Scully, get you. Oh, who's this attacking? Borar rule. You placed pretty high in this hill in real life. Oh, Scully, put your automatic then. Bye bye. Um, oh, Cyprus did. Oh, jeez. Bye bye, Cyprot. I'm just going to stay up near the front. There's Bivin. Let's start working a bit. Just moving up. Cause it is kind of skinny up here. Rumak. Don't think anyone's going to take your points jersey off you. No. But Boaro does grab some points. So put you back to normal. Uh, I suppose we make a train now, so if you were up closer maybe, so Rumark, Martinez, Bug you put Biv in there and then Trent on the end just in case. And if you get back, you will be on the front doing the work for us. If not, then I don't particularly care. Cool, let's just, what are we going to do, just pace. 76, we'll say. Ooh, as well, since Scully gets some water, because he's useless at hills. At the moment. Times two for the moment. Maybe be up the pace to 80 as we go down this hill. 14 k's to go. 85. Average eight percent, nine and a half percent. The climb is only three k's long. Energy gel on our cyprot. Here comes Scully. Oh, Scully gives the bottles. Actually, we'll hook in behind Scully, and we'll make him do some work because our cyprot is dead, and Scully is mean at hills. I mean at flat. Shove energy gel on Scully. And we'll shove it up to 99 pace. Just to try and break some people here. Blue mark. 6 case to go. You can go now as well. Scully, bye bye. Thanks for back to the help, mate. Martinez. There's this Bentacle with moving Valverde up on the outside. Almost up to the hill. There needs to be a slow motion, like, video mode in this. Okay, Martinez, you can go now. 92, Rumak, yeah, keep going, do what you're doing. 2.5, so we've got energy gel on everyone. 96, we don't want to get swamped by the peloton. 2Ks to go. Come on, you. let's get this bread. Around the outside, Bark Eels on the front. 700 meters. Trenton's dropped. Sprint with Bark Eel. Sprint with Bevan, Sprint with Trenton. And with Martinez. Okay, something's definitely wrong with this difficulty. If we are able to win with Bark Eel, then Bevan, no, oh, they might take it just in front of Bevan. Yes. And then Martinez. Okay, something needs to be changed. I'm gonna go do that now. At the end of this episode, because this is this was too easy. This one under. Way too easy. And it should not have been this easy. So thanks for joining me with the second half of the Santos Tour Down Under. I'm still looking for that software. 
for uh, editing the video so you don't have to watch the whole race where it was kind of boring of just fast forwarding and me rambling on about something. Bugger comes first. We won a lot of stages. 13 seconds on the video, okay. Trace Bugger wins overall, Trent and Bevan, and then we're still top six. Win the points with Trenton, Bagheel takes the mountain, Martinez the youth, and us the team. Okay, so that was that was way too easy. Way too easy. Gravel on tar was Ty Jones. Oh, an actual Australian. Cool. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll fiddle with the difficulty, fiddle with the rest of that in the next episode, and... See you next time. Thanks.